What is going on guys? Welcome to Gregles TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. How is everyone doing? I hope you're having a fantastic day. Today's story is all about, as you can see from the headline, the OnePlus Open supports S Pen or stylus, whatever you want to call it. I actually noticed this the other day and I was planning to make a video. I just, now there's news stories coming out about us. I was like, I might as well cover it today in my news story. But it does support S Pen. Why do we know this? First of all, how do I know it? Well, if you go into settings and then you go all the way down, you're gonna see additional settings and then you can go into stylus. And then also if you just search under stylus, a bunch of stuff pops up with features that it can do. There's stylus handwriting. So you can see uh, additional settings and uh, developer options. You have your, uh, what do you got? Oh, you can take a screenshot with the stylus. You can scroll through pages. You can do screen off notes. So when the screen's off, you can pull, take the S Pen and write directly on the screen. Delay, auto lock, and also there's updates for the stylus as well. And this is all comes to light to, because again, a bunch of stories have covered it, but so it's been on here for, I think from the time I got it, I don't think the update just pushed that out. But this too, like this tweet from Ishan Agarwal mentions a little bit more detail saying that the OnePlus Open does support stylus on both the cover and the main display while the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5 only supports it on the main one. Seems like they couldn't make the Oppo Pen available globally, uh, available only in China and select Asian markets with Oppo Find N3, weird OnePlus Open. So it looks like you're gonna have to somehow import that pen for the Find N3. But what's cool about this is that if you can, potentially you're gonna be able to use your a pen on this phone on the front and the inside displays. And it's weird, they didn't mention it at all, at least from what I saw on any of the videos introducing this phone. So it, it, hopefully it comes out later or it's an accessory you can buy for OnePlus that's not overly expensive, especially since we won't have to import it or we might have to import it in order to get any of this and all of this to work. But you know, if you're an S Pen person or stylus person, there's, you, you at least have the opportunity to use a stylus with the front and the inside displays. And that's huge, that's huge. I, there's no other folding phones in the Western world that can actually do that. And it does seemingly a lot of the same stuff that a regular S Pen will be able to do from Samsung. Some of the, at least some of the stuff. So what do you guys think? Are you gonna uh, pick up a OnePlus open now or no? Let us know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching, have a great day, and we'll see you down the road. Peace.